Hi, in this quick video demonstration, we're going to show you how to take a character head that is already fully prepared with uh, all of your morpher targets and everything here uh, and attach it to a separate uh, character body so that you keep those morpher targets so that you can continue animating with them uh, later on as well as tie your character all together so that you can uh, rig, skin, and animate uh, this sucker. If you've done your job right, uh, your amount of polygons that uh, go around your character's neck and the amount of polygons that go around the opening in your character's body for the neck uh, should be identical. They should match up and uh, everything should just kind of be ready uh, to put together and sew there. Uh, so what we've got is uh, our character's head here and it's got you know some texture work and, and a, a morphers target with all, all of these morphers set up. Uh, what we're going to do is add on to that another edit poly modifier. And then inside that edit poly modifier, which keeps our morpher targets below here, uh, we're going to use the attach button and connect that 3D body uh, that we just had. It looks like my normals got flipped there somehow, but we can select those and use the flip button to kind of turn them back around. Uh, with this edit poly modifier on top of our morpher targets, we then have the ability to kind of select our uh, uh, vertices here and uh, go through and uh, maybe increase the, the weld threshold there and start welding uh, this character's neck to the character's body. In the end, once we're all done, we've still got the ability to go down the stack and use our morpher targets, but up here at the top where we're going to put above this our uh, skinning modifier and attach our rig, uh, everything will be put together and built just nicely. So that's all there is to it. Uh, just kind of continue sewing on your character's head. If your character head and your character body have uh, a different number of vertices uh, at the opening where they should connect, you are going to have to do some work in cutting or removing edges uh, on one or the other so that you can successfully travel all the way around and sew this character's head right onto the character's body. And there you have it. After that we can add things like our mesh smooth. You'll want to get rid of your mesh smooths before you do this uh, little technique here. Uh, but then you can put them on only one back at the end and hopefully your character uh, full head, full body, and everything should be ready to go. All you need to do is texture and rig. All right.